Doctors are reminding parents to take care when raising pets in a family. A Taichung hospital recently handled the case of a baby infected with a parasite that he caught from the family pets. The child made a full recovery after several days treatment. But many diseases can be spread from animals to young children. Babies' immune systems are not yet fully developed. Doctors say hand washing is key. A little 10-month-old boy reaches out to stroke the family cat. He's full of curiosity about the pets. But parents need to keep in mind the dangers of pet ownership, especially when it comes to little kids. A young boy from Taichung went to hospital recently after having diarrhea for more than a week. He had a high fever and his parents initially thought he had a cold. Then doctors found the culprit in the diarrhea, this microbe. This is his flagellum and the two shells. It looks like a pear. A 10-month-old baby can't walk, so I asked her if they had any pets at home, and she said their cats and dogs would play with the baby, and they didn't deworm the pets regularly. This parasite lives in the digestive tracts of cats and dogs and other mammals. If adults get infected, the symptoms won't be obvious as their immune system can handle it. But children under the age of three will often get diarrhea, feel sick, and have stinky nappies. If left untreated, it will cause malnutrition and stunt development. We gave him medicine for the parasite and he was fine within five days. If kids stroke pets and don't wash their hands before eating, it's quite easy to pick up an infection. Parents with children and pets should make sure the animals are dewormed and defleed regularly and teach the children to wash their hands after cuddling animals. That way, everyone can cuddle safely.